Hello, welcome to .programming.blogspot.com. Uh, today I will show you how to clear all fields after submit the data in ESP.NET. Uh, uh, here I will um, also show uh, a confirmation message just when we send a field after post back. Okay, when we click on the save button, the data will be saved on uh, a database table or you can say that any temporary registers uh, but uh, here I will show you only how to clear the fields just after the post back of the data into the table and um, how to show uh, the message when we send uh, data to the table or you can say save the data to the table okay let's uh, to open visual studio and create a project or you can say website and create a simple uh, registration form uh, like username password and email okay uh, now add a text fields for username password and email also add a button control when we click on the button control then uh, raise a click event okay uh, now in the click event uh, we can handle our event handling code uh, like the post back data and generating the message so uh, you can uh, do this by using the javascript uh, in the c sharp code behind file if if you want to apply uh, if you know about uh, how to apply the uh, javascript in code behind file you can easily you can do this uh, program okay uh, so first of all uh, get all the fields into a variable so I have a, a message string that is a variable name and in your message is your detail have been saved or you can say successfully submitted so your detail has uh, have been saved in the message strings also uh, take another parameters so window dot onload equals to function there is a alert message you want to show here so window dot onload when uh, data is post back then occurs this message window dot onload functions with the alert message proper alert message so also add by value operator add it with the contents now close the alert uh, message by the brackets uh, actually uh, we can use javascript in code behind file uh, by using the client script file uh, dot you can say uh, all events of the javascript we can handle using the client scripts okay so here also we, we can use uh, client script just after creating your proper message in the content string uh, that is the string that is request.url.absolute uri that's clear the uh, fields just after post back the data okay that's only one uh, field for required to clear the data that is request.url.absoluteuri okay so I have used client script dot register client script block 
or you can say use register startup script okay register in the register startup script define the type then after you can use string that is a key and last one is a string scripts so this dot get type and the string key is a success message and string script is actually contained by the contain variable and after that you can use the boolean value in the register startup script run this uh, page and see your output that is proper not not it will take some time to uh, view your application in the browser so wait and type the username password and email okay hello hello world hello at the rate of gmail.com proper message then after clicking to ok request start absolute URI is run so if you want to run if you want to clear all fields without any message so you can use a simple request.url.absoluteuri and response.redirect method okay so uh, give him proper message if you do not want to print success message so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorials please keep watching my all video tutorials thank you thank you very much